everyone and welcome back to the Knock Knock Artist. Today I'll be teaching you guys how to draw fries and cheeseburger from McDonald's. Now the supplies you'll need are simple. A piece of white paper, a permanent marker. Today we're not going to be using pencil, we're just going to draw with the permanent marker. And something to color with. I'll be using markers. You can use color pencils if you want. Now let's get started. First, grab your permanent marker. Then we're gonna draw the hamburger first. We're gonna draw the hamburger from this part of the paper and then it'll overlap with the fries behind it. First, start here. Draw a big arch. Then connect these two, like that. And we can draw the sesame on top of the burger. If you want to use yellow or something to draw, it's fine. Now let's move on to the <coughs> toppings. First, we'll draw the lettuce. Start from the end and draw um, curves all the way to the end. They don't have to be equal because lettuce aren't always equal. Now let's draw the um, tomato. Start here, go down, curve, and there. And then we're going to draw the last topping, the meat. Start here, this time curve. And curve back, like that. And then we'll draw the um, bread from the bottom. Go down again. And go up. And we're done with our hamburger. Now let's draw the fries. We're going to draw the fries here. But the, we'll make it look like the cheeseburger is in front of the um, fries. Start from here and draw upside down arch. Make it go down and then arch again and you have your box. Now, since we want it to be McDonald fries, we have to remember to draw the M. First draw it like that. Put a line here, trace it again. Like that. Then let's draw the last part of this whole picture. The fries. Start from the right. Draw a long and thin rectangle. Then draw another one that's different size. Keep drawing them until you get all the way here. Also make them different sizes to, so they, they look more like fries. They can also be thinner or larger or wider. Their height can always change as well. Like that. And we're done with the fries. Now we have finished our set, it's time to color. I'll be fast forwarding, you can always copy mine, or you can use your creativity and make your own. <laughs> The colors I used are these colors. Let me tell you about the yellow first. The yellow I used to color the McDonald's sign and of course the fries. But then I used a little bit of orange to make the fries even more realistic. And I 
also used the orange to color the cheeseburger's bread. Then I used this green to color the lettuce, the red to color the McDonald fries box, and the tomato. And of course I used brown to color the meat. And that's about all. Thanks for watching. Remember, if you're done, you can always show me. Bye.